guys! I feel like my greeting should get higher and higher pitched every day, so get ready for that shit. Um, it's 11.38, I'm on my first delivery. There's a huge catering order in right now, but uh, we have a new delivery driver, which is really exciting. So I think I'm gonna let him take it and taste what it's like to get a $20 tip, because he's gonna get a $20 tip. But yeah, it's been a pretty relaxed day so far. Um, I'm really excited because I'm gonna upload a song and you're probably gonna have heard it by the time you watch this video, so it's kind of a moot point for me to be talking about it right now. Um, can you hear that whistling? It's my window. It's slowly falling down. I have tape put right there, uh, but it's not really holding the window up anymore. Oh my God. All right, well, I don't want this day to be about me getting angry at drivers, but like, see all these people in front of me? Yep, they're all the worst. Look, look, they're on my car. Oh God. A couple of you brought up some good points about love bugs in the comments the other day. Um, they destroy the paint on your car, not because they eat it or anything, but because they die on it. The acid from their corpses just eats away your paint and it's horrible. They're like a fucking plague. It's disgusting. Ooh, state trooper. I am obeying every law, except for maybe the law that you can't use a device while you're driving. Just film and count. Like, I assume there's never gonna be legislation that states, you know, do not film yourself while you're driving. I know, like, people use cell phones all the time and there's, you know, all the fiasco about whether or not that's illegal. Um, what about filming? What about talking to a camera while you're driving? Is that, is that ever gonna be illegal? Maybe if everyone started vlogging and just fucking sucking at driving. Actually, that'd be sweet because everyone would be getting in car accidents. So it'd be great vlog footage for everyone. You see, you gotta look on the bright side of things. Holy shit, guys. Remember how I told you we had a new delivery driver? Well, what's awesome about that is that now during the lunch rush, I don't have to do like 15 deliveries like at a time and I get to leave early. It's 310. Wah! Also, I just got a text from Jesse. She says, there may be a cookie in your back seat. Enjoy. So I look back there. <laughs> See that star shaped thing? Yep. That's a cookie from the film festival. Honestly, I don't know what to do with my day. I usually get out at like five, so I have a couple extra hours on my hands right now. So I think I'm gonna go edit early. Well, I guess relatively, this is relatively early. Um, and upload that song, cause that's fun. And probably hang out with my sister, I don't know. She's probably bored out of her mind now that Charles is gone. So I think I might see what she's up to. So just today, my car started doing this fucked up thing where if I'm driving and I'm accelerating, the wheel, it's, it's gonna be hard to illustrate this, but like the wheel will be right here and I'm accelerating and it's normal. But once I let off the gas, the wheel goes like this and jerks to the left. Then the car starts pulling to the left ever so slightly, which I don't know what that means, but my dad seems to think it might be something serious, like the rack and pinion being fucked up or something. I don't know, but guys, this is my livelihood right now. So I don't really wanna be fucking with it. So I'm gonna try to be careful be safe I'm not gonna drive like a maniac but I still have to drive so I'm gonna take the risk I'm actually headed to the Florida Studio Theater for a script reading event I think uh, I'm gonna meet Dot and Jesse there and maybe Yuki later and then I actually bought a ticket to the midnight sexy shorts package which <laughs> I'm not really sure what those are about I can only assume they're about sex maybe in the middle of the night I don't know but uh, it should be interesting. Here we are at the Florida studio. Oh, FST. Dude, that brings back horrible memories. I had a math book called FST. It meant function, statistics, and trigonometry. I was back in high school. That was back when I did math. Uh, that was horrible. This isn't so horrible. This is all artsy and stuff. So that's cool. Um, I have to call a doc because I have no idea where I'm going. I know this is the place, but there's like 15 doors and I don't know which one to go in. Look at that. I found it because I called that. I was lost. <laughs> I made it. Okay, I'm gonna watch this now. Holy shit, guys. It is 3 in the morning. It has been a non-stop movie night. You may go. I am not even at the stop sign yet. I think I told you a little bit earlier about the shorts package we were watching. It was the Midnight Sexy shorts, and a lot of them were very inappropriate, and that means they were also very awesome. <laughs> there was one called Other that was the fucking shit. It was like, I don't want to spoil it. If you're in Sarasota right now, I don't know why you would be. Maybe you live here. Um, please, on Wednesday, I think it's at 9.30 p.m., go see the Sexy Short package. 
midnight sexy shorts it's twelve dollars i think for admission that's what i paid to get in um they're awesome they're all either funny or gruesome or just in general like really entertaining so you should go see those also dot informed me earlier this evening that melancholia the lars von Trier movie that came out last year i believe i think it was 2011 um is available on netflix so naturally we watched it and that shit was also awesome like 100 percent of that movie is the most beautiful thing you'll ever see it's just it's so crazy and like it's it's really heavy honestly i think what hooked me most about melancholia was like the the thing that was happening in the background, which I don't really want to ruin it, but it's like this sci-fi twist sort of that's happening and like it gets revealed like slowly throughout the story and it's Oh man, it's just good. You should just watch it. It's on Netflix. If you have Netflix, fucking watch it. Anyway, I think I am done for the day. Like I said, it's three. I have to get up in maybe four hours to bring this car to the shop with my dad. Because uh, we got to get it looked at because there's something. I, I showed you earlier. The steering wheel just fucking fucked. Maybe I can show you right now. Um, all right. So, yeah, here we go. I want to film the wheel. So, this is the wheel. I'm accelerating. Watch when I, like, let off the gas. You see that? I did not do that. Did you see it go whoop? Like, I'm not doing that. And now the car is, like, pulling a little bit to the left. Whereas before, it was pulling a little bit to the right. Anyway, uh, we got to get that looked at because that seems really dangerous. Uh, so I'm going to wake up pretty early and get that done. So have a good night, guys. What? <laughs>